you guys let's get the first sip of coffee in so today I decided to do a cappuccino make espresso shots because the roast for day two 12 days of coffee is or 12 mornings of coffee is it I think it's 12 mornings of coffee I just been saying 12 days of coffee it's, it said it was very dark this is good I like this the nice thing with this is that you might try a roast that you fall absolutely fall in love with and you want to reorder you get to try all these different roasts but we're going to be leaving today to Chitola Resort in Blowing Rock, North Carolina I was looking up different places around here we're kind of new to this area we're staying in North Carolina we've been here since I think end of August or maybe beginning of September September 1st like around there so we've been here for a few months we've been really loving North Carolina so many cute small towns, small communities. We love seeing the mountain ranges as you're driving, absolutely stunning. But I was looking at places that might potentially get snow around the holidays. And then I was talking to somebody here and she mentioned that look into Boone and they also recommend Blowing Rock. They recommended Beach Mountain, which is a ski resort. So there's there's just so much. So I started doing a little bit of research and I came across Chitola Resort. It reminds me a lot of Lake Placid. We used to go to, uh, what was it called? Crown Plaza. It was like a super cozy log in type vibes. And we used to go there almost every single Christmas season. So I thought, let's continue the tradition here in North Carolina. And that's where we're gonna go today. So I'll take you guys along for that. And we're just gonna stay overnight. I took the kids bathing suits because it says they have an indoor pool, indoor hot tub. My kids love that. Yes. So that should be really fun. Okay. We were originally supposed to go the following week, but I changed it to this week because it said there might be some flurries. And I feel like coming from New York, we are so used to seeing snow. So I'm really praying and hoping that we see like a flurry or two. So we'll see, we will see. I'm so excited, kids are so excited for snow. We got so lucky last year. We were in Branson, we were staying with my brother-in-law and then we went to Branson for Christmas and stayed there for a month. And we were super lucky enough to literally wake up to snow and see snow, cause coming from New York it just, it feels weird not having like a white Christmas, you know? But I'm not complaining about the cold. The cold we do not miss at all. We are all set and ready to go. This is my OOTD for the road. I forgot I had these boots. I got them from Misguided, I think. And now Misguided is out of business or something. I don't know. And this jacket is also from Misguided. Sucks they closed down because they had some really cute, affordable, like really nice items. They're not the best, best, best quality, but for the price, I'd say they're pretty good. But yeah, we are all packed up. We're just getting ready and packing ourselves into the car. I will be home for a couple of days. Wonder around with you. You and me in the cold thought it never be true. Wherever I go, I got you. Oh, I have stopped running. There is no way trying. You better loosen your belt. Drinking up wine by the fire. Don't care of anything else. It's Christmas. And some kind of love, my friend. We made it to, I think it's called Chetala, the GPS side, but I could be wrong. My husband's going in to get the registration to check in. And it looks so cute here. No snow yet. I follow Beach Mountain Resort on Instagram. My husband has my phone. There was a little weather report saying that Beach Mountain is supposed to get, I think, up to seven inches. And Beach Mountain is, I believe, one of the highest peaks east of the Mississippi. No. I think there might be a grandfather peak above it. And then we're like in the middle at, was it, I forgot how much elevation, I'll have to write it here because I forgot, I already forgot, it was like on my, in my brain and then it just disappeared. But um, yeah, it looks so cute and cozy and people come here, it's open to the public to look at all the Christmas lights because it's like super decorated for Christmas. People can just like drive through and walk around, they have the lake behind us that way and then they have 
the lodge, the inn. I wish I could stay here for two days. It's so cute. Let's check, look for our room. Let's go. We're on the, yeah, we're on the third floor. Oh, look how cozy. Wow. Okay, we're room 30 something. Yeah, I have the cards. I guess it's, I guess it's already open. Yeah, I guess. All right, let's go check it out. Oh, it's so cute. Just like the pictures. Look at this. You guys ready picking your beds? So cute. And we got a balcony with the views of the lake. We got a little table here. A kitchen. Oh, yeah, a little mini fridge. Wow, look at this. So this is where we were first parked. That's where we came in from there. And then this is the lake. Let's turn on some Christmas music in here. Do you like to be here too? It's Christmas. Outside snow's glistening. We got here around two and we were able to check in our room as early, even though check-in's at three, so that was nice. We got all settled in. This is their bathroom, by the way. Everything is like really nice and clean. Like I'm really impressed with they have a little makeup station here so so far we love it it's so cute and cozy and they have like reclaimed wood all along the wall definitely gives you those super cozy vibes we're gonna go explore a little bit grab something to eat because we want to basically spend the entire evening swimming they have an indoor pool here with a hot tub and just kind of do that for the rest of the day and then Towards the evening we do want to walk around and look at all the lights and stuff so we're thinking mellow mushroom for food we went there in Branson, we were in Missouri, downtown Branson, like the strip, they have mellow mushroom and we really loved it. Even though it's a chain, it was really good. So we're thinking that because it's family friendly, kids love pizza, we love pizza, and the pizza is actually really good. Look at those mountain views in the back. We decided to try a local restaurant instead. That's beautiful. It's cute. It's a cute little restaurant. Everybody kind of sits around this area here. We all put our bathing suits on and we're gonna go head out to the pool, explore the pool before it Hello. closes. Hello. My cutie person. I can't wait to go to the pool. Mom. I know, you guys are so excited to go to the pool. There. That's the plan and then come back, shower, and by that time it's gonna be dark out so we get to walk around outside maybe have some s'mores because I think it said it had some s'mores and then just come home have a little Christmas movie night. The restaurant we went to we decided to go to like a local one. It was really cute. It's not really a Eden restaurant but they had like this one if you ever go to Hibachi you know how they have like those U-shaped tables and the chef is in the middle. It was like similar to that so that's like the only seating that they had. It was pretty good. We enjoyed it. The chicken wings were really really good. Found it. Yeah. Oh yeah there's Oh, this is pretty. We got all the things that you need here. Is this a sauna? Wow, they have a sauna and a hot tub. This whole area is so cute. So they have a separate room for the hot tub. And then over there, my kids are in the indoor heated pool, and they have like a little outdoor patio. Oh my gosh, this is so cute! I would totally come back here just for the little recreation area. It looks like we're the only ones in here, but this is so nice. So nice. Wow, this is nice. Can't really film in here because there's Christmas music playing, which I'm not mad at because I'm loving these Christmas vibes. But just chilling here on this little seat of sorts, watching the kids. My husband's talking to some folks in the um, in the hot tub. Decided to go in the sauna for a little bit, you guys. It is roasted and toasted. I feel like a roast chicken. I don't think I can handle it. Okay, take a walk. Yeah, we should definitely take a walk. Well, we got to dry our hair first. And unfortunately, they don't have s'mores. The s'mores are only on the weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, so no s'mores for us, but we still want to walk around. Sitting here, I'm going to edit the vlogmas today. 
all the footage they have from today to have it ready for tomorrow. My husband went to Food Lion to get pick up like some snacks. I feel like after swimming you always get so hungry. So he went to Food Lion to get some snacks. Just like some little things. They do have a fridge here. They have a microwave, which is really nice. Little mini coffee maker. They do have room service, but I looked at their menu and it didn't look very kid friendly. And we're not like starving, starving since we had an early dinner. But after swimming, you do want like a little bit of something, you know? I'm drinking hot wine by the fire. Here alone, we got nothing to fear. It's Christmas. Oh. All decked out for Christmas. It's actually pretty cold out. It got really cold really fast. It's supposed to be even colder tomorrow. All right, and we're going back because it's freezing. I do feel like it was a lot more Christmassy in the photos I had online. It's still really cute. For the pictures, it was like all oh, bright and Christmassy. But I'm ready to go inside, so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and hanging out. See you guys in tomorrow's vlog. Tonight I'll spend all this Christmas with you.